Hi guys, I'm back again. Um, I've got coffee because my hands are freezing. Anyone who knows me in person will know I hate putting heating on. So, I'm sat with a coffee and I'm wearing a hat and a big jumper because we're not putting heating on yet. Um, Cornwall has decided that we are definitely changing the seasons. So, for the last week we have had rain and now we've got mediocre winds. So the trees outside are like swaying. Um, not why I'm here. I'm not here to complain about the weather. What I am here to do is to show you um, two things. I'm looking down because they're either side of me. The first thing, which... Oh, I'm going to move my cup because otherwise my cup's going to go in it. Which I've not shown before because I started it yesterday, finished it today, is this. Hi. Um, this head mold's really small. So this is my friend's son, well both sons, but particularly one, plays Zelda. This is a Boko Oblin, I think that's how you say it. Not sure. I don't play Zelda. Like I like old video games. I like Mario. Um, but she sent me a picture and went, "Can you make this?" And I went, "Yeah, probably." So she's like, "Will you make this?" I was like, oh yeah, okay. Um, <laughs> so we have a hat. I've done it. The tiny human it's going for is, is he six? He's coming up six. Um, so I've given it a neck strap and a button. There we go, button goes under. And it will double up as like a neck warmer as well, like undercoats and stuff. So it's got little teeth, some really cute little ears. I really love this yarn colour and I can't remember what it's called and I did buy two balls and I bought two balls thinking I'm going to need two balls and I didn't, I didn't even use the whole of one. It's got a cute little horn, up on top one green eye, one blue eye which I kind of love because my partner has one blue eye and one brown and green. So always a quirky mixture with eyes. And a little nose. Um, yeah, so we have this. He's cute. I am kind of in love with him. Um, Quinton, who is my middle tiny human, who is, what is he? He's just gone seven. No, he hasn't just gone seven. He's just turned eight. And now wants a monster hat because of seeing this. So I might make these in some funky colours and then they could just be monster hats. I kind of like it with sad ears, but the ears are pointing downwards. But yeah, I'm happy with how it's turned out. But this is going to its new home tomorrow, so I thought I'd better film this so you guys can see. My cheese plant is touching me. Um, so that. The other thing, um, I don't know if I mentioned that I was making a patchwork sweater or cardigan for my oldest tiny human. I showed the one for Merrick who is five. Yeah, he's five. It's really hard to remember all these ages. Um, this one is for oh, Louis who is 11, nearly 12. He's 12 in December. I want to try and pop some pictures on. Um, if you follow me on Instagram, You'd have seen this today because I posted pictures. I finished it. I think I actually finished at the start of the week. But just didn't get around to taking pictures. And I took pictures this morning. With my grumpy preteen wearing it. But yeah. Um, it's very loosely based on the Harry Styles cardigan. As in it's just made of Patrick squares. Um... <laughs> 
but crocheted it looks it reminds me of Alma the elephant like the every color elephant but it's cute he loves it he actually left it downstairs he normally wears it up to bed so I might pop that up on his bed on the way past but that is all I have for you see quick video um I don't know when I'll be back I am currently knitting um, I'm knitting the wrist warmers from the Harry Potter set that I bought but I broke one of the needles because the needles are wood and I've just I think I left it in a box and the box might get stood on it's kind of what it looks like because tiny humans if there's a box they think it's theirs um, so I like my little cockatiel my hair is getting longer um, so I need to transfer that onto metal needles which I prefer anyway I don't like wooden needles because it's slower it grabs but I've nearly finished the first one then I need to start the second one and then they're made flat and you just seam them up so hopefully I can get that done in the next couple of days so I'll be back to show you those um yeah that's all I've got for you I hope you are all doing well I hope that you're not having to deal with this weather. I don't mind the rain. I don't like going out in it though. And today we had a home day, so pajamas was like, yay! Pajamas and DVDs. We watched a lot of Narnia today. Um, and my eight-year-old has just picked up the book. I have a book which was mine when I was young. Um, and it's all the Chronicles of Narnia in one big book. So he's reading The Magician's Nephew, which is the first of those books. So we'll see how he gets on with that. He read The Hobbit over lockdown, so I know it's not <laughs> beyond his abilities, but he might get bored and give up. Also, obviously, he can't take that book to school because it's huge. So it'll be his at-home reading, opposed to his school reading, which he also has to do at home. So, I don't know. Right. I love you all, and I'll speak to you all really soon. Bye, guys.